Hello friends, welcome to my channel, a channel for learning simple coding. If you find this video to be helpful, please like, share and subscribe my channel. In this video, we are going to build one more project in React Native that is document scanner. So we are going to build a document scanner in React Native by using document scanner library is called React Native document scanner. This library is excellent for scanning documents and images. You see, we have a demo also. So for installing this, you just need to copy this and install it in your project. I have already installed and you know now how to install it. So do yourself. One more property that you have to change after installation, just open Android and gradle.property file and there just copy this line. Uh, if you are using a new project then already this line is inserted so please check if this line is already inserted in your gradle.property file then do not repeat it if it not installed then just copy and paste there after that you don't have to do anything just you have to use the library so after installation and setting a small line of property in your file we have to make an application to scan a document for that we need to use these packages so i just copy this image and document and i have already created a package my scanner so in this my scanner i just paste these lines and i import this package so this package we have imported image and react native is already there so we can write here also image from react native so no need of using this then we have document scanner from this now again we have to copy this line also so these state variable and we have to use this function also for scanning a document that's very very simple so we are just paste here so you see that we have document scanner function here and uh, for a scan document we have this document scanner object this object we are using to scan the value and we have this if we have more than zero means we in this array if we have click any document or we have an image so length will increase greater than zero then we will see and first image we will put in the this image so now we have to set some make some setting here you see that we have certain properties also like we have image quality scan document you see maximum number of document then we have quality of this so we have a crop image quality so i copy this and i need to make it 100% so i need 100% quality here paste it and i say 100% like this way save this now i provide here the data type that is a string type save this and i use here use state also like that save this now we uh, have this document image we have we are setting this here set image now because it's generating an error so we put here one more thing that we say scan image not equal to not equal to null and so if it is not equal to equal to null save this so if this object is not equal to null means we have scanned some document and the length of this is greater than zero uh, then we will do the saving of this image in this state variable so everything is okay now now i need to restart it because it's showing some error undefined is not a function okay that is the problem image save this okay i just uh, restart it so i close this application and i try to restart because it's generating some error so i close it and i try to restart it meanwhile is to restart then we do more now i need to create an image also here and a button also so here I say image we already have this coding also so we go to the code and you see that we have already this kind of code for images so I need this image also and here I will pass this scanned image we are using here use effect function for calling a scan document function but we will use a button to call it so I just copy this and here in a style I need to pass a styles dot and I say image and the source I need to pass URI and I pass the sources uh, that is scanned image scanned image dot to string that I need to pass inside this 
so this library is a scanned image so I need this and paste it here like this and I will set this also and I say to a string like that I need to pass it so it is an image and uh, uh, it will have the data it will display image only when I have the image so I say if a scan image a scan image this not equal to null if this is not equal to null then we have to display image and in place of button I say touchable opacity so touchable opacity I take this here I say style here and here in this style we can pass styles dot button and here inside this text so we say text and here in this text I say scan document like this save this okay problem is there in use state so I need to take use state from a react not a react native so from here I need to take use state save this now it is working so by mistake we have just by mistake I just import it here from the react native it's a part of react so we just use use state here now everything is okay button we have image we have and we have a scan document here so we need to make some style for this button also for image also so for that uh, for this image I need a function to open this so I say uh, on press and here we call I say scan document this function directly we can call on press of this that will click image done now we have to give some styling so here I say uh, that first of all we need container I say flex equal to 1 and I put this uh, container here so I say style equal to styles dot container save this now I take setting for button so I take button here and I say uh, button uh, position so I say position of this button should be absolute and we should have the bottom of this should be uh, 30 save this you see the down we have and I say uh, self alignment we need to the center save this you see everything is okay now I take uh, for text also so I say style equal to styles dot text and I can say text button now I need uh, background color also I say background color here and I say that color is red save this then I say border radius I say 10 here like this I say 5 now I take text button I say here uh, font size should be 30 pixel like this scan document I say font weight should be bold like this then I say padding should be 10 like this good and I say the color of this is white save this like this way you see we have a button scan document and uh, I can take background color to green also green look better like this way and uh, uh, width I can also increase so I say the padding is 15 like this way so you see that whenever I click on this we should open an image and we have to set the width and height of image also so I say image coordinates the width of image should be we say 100% height should be we say 70% like this way save this now I try to use it if I click here and it will use uh, uh, my laptop uh, camera remember that because uh, we we are using this library on uh, the simulator emulator we are using on an emulator that's why we are not using a actual camera of a mobile so I click here and it will you see possibly handle promises rejections so why we have this problem so library we have already react native document plugin we have async await we have 100% quality we have try to do once again I click on this 
so we had a error error we have because uh, I'm using the emulator and uh, the webcam together webcam is also using the camera and uh, this emulator is also using the camera so now I have adjust all these things now you will see that whenever I click on this it will show me the scanning camera and I'm using the laptop camera and here I can give this type of image in front of my laptop camera like this and uh, I click uh, you see like this like that way and I click on this and it will click the image and I click OK because the quality of laptop is not good that's why it's showing like this and uh, we can adjust this image size whatever you want you see like this so like this way and we do like this and this way we can make adjustment image click here you see this image is coming here so like this way you can scan your document and one more thing we can do we can also we can also make this button as a professional scanning button uh, for that uh, I remove this remember I remove this and uh, I need to remove this text button also like this way and uh, I save this and uh, button we have document we have and then I say the width of this is uh, 60 and I say height of this is also 60 save this you see we have this one this type of button and uh, I say the color is uh, black or red we can say like this way and I say the radius of this is uh, 30 you see we have a just a circle type of button now I again restart it and you will feel that we have a professional type of look in this application I click again and it will show you the document scanner remember that I am using a laptop camera so but if you will use in real mobile then you will have a better camera better quality also so I just put this kind of image here and I click on this it will scan my image you see I click OK and now I can crop whatever I want what type of quality I want I can just crop it whatever the image I have it's a free library open library and I click OK and you will see that we have the crop image so like that way you may have your own document scanner image scanner you can scan your document the quality is excellent but I am using a laptop camera that is only of 2 megapixel bad quality camera and I am also recording the video by my webcam so there is a little bit of uh, you can say fighting between two application they are trying to access the same hardware that's why I have uh, given this permission to use my laptop camera to this emulator and uh, my recording from the webcam so but if you will use this application in a real mobile application then you will have a better quality and better performance also so by this video I try to uh, show you that uh, how you can say you can uh, create your application in react native to scan your document at free of cost I think you like this video if you like it please do subscribe thank you for watching this video